Hello, my name is Abe. Welcome back to Enter the Fungin <laughs> as the robot. You know what? If we're gonna have a nice, fun, warm-up robot run, I'd rather play as a robot. That made no sense. I just said the word robot twice. Hold up. Looks like you finished. All hail! The Master Gungeoneer returns! Take a bow. But the hunt goes on. We get the gun zang. Oh! I know someone probably, and probably many people said, hey, when you defeat the Kill Pillars, you're gonna unlock the Gun Zang. Yeah, I might not have been paying any attention to the specific gun unlocks, but now that I have the Gun Zang, I'm like, ooh, Gun Zang. Ooh, a piece of candy. I enjoy me a good Gun Zang. It's got some pretty cool, interesting synergies and weird effects that can happen with certain bullet effects. I'm a big fan. And I'm not talking about the Isaac item either. That's a fun game, Isaac. <laughs> I've played exactly two runs of Isaac in the past, like, maybe nine months. It was that Tainted Eden run that I randomed, and then it was the G Fuel Daily. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta think, like, Maybe we could keep playing more Isaac. Maybe we should like start another save file of Isaac. I mean, I did the same thing with Gungeon, right? We could do the same thing with Isaac. It would take a million GD years to actually unlock anything. I mean, it, it took me maybe 300 runs of Isaac to unlock everything, but how many runs of Gungeon does it take to unlock everything in this game? I guess we're, we're still making progress towards the uh, the completion of hunting quests, but at least in Isaac, it's all individual run stuff. I'm not, ta I'm not talking about finding all the items and picking them up, just unlocking everything. You know, in Isaac, there's uh, 34 characters? You have to defeat one, two, three, four different endings with each character which means you would have to play the game, because I'm thinking Void, Chest, Dark Path, Alt Path. Oh, there's also Mom Path. So there's five different endings. So 34 times five. I mean, we're talking about freaking uh, 170 different runs in order to finish the game. I don't even know if we have 170 runs on this Gungeon save file. Like, what do you have to do in Gungeon? You defeat your past once with each character, and then you unlock uh, the true final boss, which is uh, the Lich, and then you don't even really have to defeat the Lich anymore. Actually, I guess you do have to in order to um, do the Gunslinger unlock. But, like, that's it. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da. Dun, 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 dun. Brendan Toad asks, Abe, have you heard of the four-player Isaac mod? I have not, but uh, actually, no, I have. I think you can have like four players, each player playing um, Jacob and Esau, and it just makes it absurd and annoying and very difficult, and you have no idea what's happening on the screen. That, that rings a bell. Milk Jug says, I'm self-medicating me medicating my COVID with candy. I am uh, sorry to hear that you have caught the death. Be well. Do not uh, infect me with your plague, please. Ranistan says, Isaac Deathless save file. Well, th I mean, that's an interesting um, point to make. First of all, insanely hard. I don't know if anyone's actually done that. Uh, secondly, I actually think in Isaac, some unlocks require you to die. Like, uh, the shears. Don't you have to die a hundred times? You know, Isaac's one of those games where you gotta spend the, the hundreds of runs in order to unlock everything. Everything. Architras says, last gun unlocked. Grey Mauser. Fair. I always forget about the Grey Mauser. I always forget what tier it's in. I always forget that it's a gun, that it exists, but uh, it's a nice one. Anything that lets you steal is something that you should keep your eye on in the Gunjon. I think he's getting electrocuted. We're focusing this guy down. Sorry, Shades. No real need for uh, an additional weapon here when you've got the 
robot's starting weapon. Yo, stand on this. Thank you. Hello. 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 Yeah, good. Good job. You dead yet? Almost. He's dead. Okay. Milk Jug says, I didn't even get it doing something fun. My stupid ass roommate brought it home. <laughs> so they're the ones who did something fun. You're just the one that has to suffer. Architraz says, tainted, lost, death list run attempts make people cry. Has anyone, uh, has anyone done a, a death list Isaac? Like at least doing as much as they could without requiring the shears? If so, like, congrats, you effing Latians. Well, that sucks. Um, we are going to not buy the duct tape, which is highly unfortunate, because I freaking love duct tape. I was kind of hoping maybe we could find something that lets us steal, but that's not what's going to happen. No uh, grappling hook. Bullet time doesn't let you steal. Uh, we also cannot afford it. Disappointing. I don't know why. Well, I guess I completely know why. Whenever I'm thinking, man, I wish there were two more cents. Look at all these barrels. In my head, I'm thinking Wizard of Legend. Because in Wizard of Legend, barrels do have money, randomly and rarely. But it looks like on this run, we're not gonna be able to afford a damn thing. Unless we get a lucky, like, 50 credit drop. We could open up the brown chest, but I'm just gonna do my normal thing, I think. Maybe we'll get a little bit lucky and we'll get a key. Well, even a key doesn't do anything. Well, it saves us money. Oh, good. <laughs> you stupid game. Um, well, I mean, if we can't buy bullet time, can we buy, like, I don't know, plague pistol? We could buy the plague pistol. You know, I'm not going to. I'm just gonna leave. Just don't fall into the pit while you're scratching your nose, Abe. Bronx Bomber says there was another update to Repentance. You can take a look at that. I mean, I did, uh, that was the G Fuel Daily. I played the, um, well, I mean, there's more changes, but it's all like just balancing stuff, who cares? Only a nerd is gonna make a video saying, Repentance update, buffs and nerfs, click here to find out what's good and what's bad. But, uh, yeah, I don't care. <laughs> I played the, the, the daily, because everyone was like, oh man, this daily. It sure is something fun. Ladair says, don't forget green mode. Um, one, two, I guess you're right. Yeah, I was thinking main path. There's greed mode. Although you don't need to do greedier mode. Oh, well, actually you do in order to unlock greed mode. I don't know how you unlock greedier mode. Is it just unlocked by default? Anyway, so that's like another one. So it's almost 200, well, oh. Almost 200 runs of Isaac in order to unlock anything. That's ridiculous. It's a lot of freaking Isaac. Das Bolt says, hey Abe, what game performs the best in terms of YouTube viewership? Let's ask YouTube. Hey YouTube. Um, I imagine you're watching the Gungeon run that you're watching right now because you're watching the Gungeon run. Uh, what is your other, fa you know, the call to action right here. I'm, I'm in interacting with the YouTube chat. What is your other favorite game that I play? Do you like FTL, Slay the Spire, Isaac, Monster Train? Do you like something with a little bit more, uh, a little bit more gravitas to it? Maybe like a Hollow Knight? Children of Morta, Into the Breach. How are we going to know what you... Actually, Mud says, how are we going to knit what YouTube says? I don't know, you can just, you know, buy the yarn yourself, but if you want to know what YouTube says, uh, we can just go to YouTube chat in about four days and, you know, read the comments. <laughs> That's what I'm planning on doing, if I remember. Um, I mean, people, people definitely like the Gungeon. How about XCOM 2? You guys like XCOM 2? No? All right, fair enough. You like the Dead Space playthrough I did like four years ago? No? Okay. Um, 
You guys like Rocket League? No? Okay. Um. What other games? You like Monolith? <laughs> you like Scourgebringer? <laughs> Abe forgetting about Dead Cells. I didn't forget, I just forgot. I chose not to remember. Dun, 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 dun. Architras says ST STS, Lay the Spire, or FTL second. I would probably agree. Su surprisingly, or maybe not surprisingly, what performs best on Twitch for me is usually Slay the Spire. I haven't played it in a while because I'm kind of tired of it because I played like 400 runs of it up on YouTube. But I, whenever I was playing it, when I came back and tried to do the uh, A20 heart runs again, that's some pretty good viewership. It is substantially decreased since I stopped playing it. But I don't know, is that a good thing? Is that a bad thing? You know, if I say, I will play games that we both enjoy, I pledge not to just grind and farm out one video game forever because it's the, something that gives me viewership. Oh my god, I'm doing the same thing with Gungeon right now. I almost blew myself up. Other, uh, what other games and runs have I done in the past? Like, most recently? I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> in one ear, out the other, basically. Please get him, please get him, thank you. I don't think, what was the last, like, main game that I played? Cuphead DLC, oh boy. Terraria, oh boy. Now I'm curious. There was some game that I was playing the other day. Hold on, where's my, my playlists? YouTube changed their, their, their like order of operations here. Cult of the Lamb was the last game I played. And then before that, Nuclear Throne. Oh my God, I actually have more Elden Ring episodes than Nuclear Throne episodes. Elden Ring was a long ass game. 403 Slay the Spire. Rogue Legacy 2, Dead Cells 200, Monolith 150, Darkest Dungeon 100, Subnautica 20, Ori 26 and 8, Children of Morta 16, Spelunky 2 70, Spelunky 2 Multiplayer 10, Hades 60, Hades was fun, Noita, Fury, Go, uh, Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy, Exit, The Gungeon, Terraria, Celeste. Aratus, Doom Eternal, Doom 2016, Crying Suns, Rimworld, Subnautica, Baba Is You, Di apparently I'm just going through all my playlists now, Dicey Dungeons, Sekiro, Vagante, Hollow Knight, More Darkest Dungeons, Old Dark Souls 3, Dead Space and Dead Space 2, Borderlands 2, Rocket League, um, and then we're getting into some like real old stuff at that point that has like two videos. Alcatraz says, Hades was a damn blast. It was. It was a fun game. I don't think I did everything in uh, in Hades technically, but I got like most of it. Monster Train is like at 470, isn't it? Monster Train is at like 280, I want to say. Hold on, let me look. Um, I'm surprised that that is still going. Yeah, 277. <laughs> Told ya. Look, I might occasionally miss a day, but I do uh, remember some numbers in my head. Ronasan says, dang, what was I thinking of? You're probably thinking of Spire, which is at uh, 400. Das Bolt says, Elden Ring was hilarious. He didn't care at all about spending gears or upgrading. <laughs> Yeah, I may have lost like 8 million runes, but it's all in good fun. I can't believe... Oh my god, spoilers for Elden Ring. I can't believe the first time I, I lost... ...so many runes. I, I was trying to get to a million, and then I died to a big ball. <laughs> On my attempt to get to a million runes, I was like, like I was at like 980,000 and I died to a big ball. How embarrassing. 
Isaac is at 500 thanks to the G fuel. Isaac is at like 300. Oh, you know what? There was prob I probably reordered it from zero when uh, Repentance came out. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, we're done with this floor. Let's get the heck out of here. Do we have the crest? No, we don't. Let's go grab it. Anyways, I mean, when you when you when you say it like that, it sounds like what the hell am I doing with my life? <laughs> Hundreds of runs of Gungeon, Slay the Spire, and Isaac, but these games are pretty fun, you know. Mr. Accretion Jr. You are an interesting gun. Oh, uh, okay, I've got a, a bit of an anecdote for people today. Oh God, I was lucky, because I just literally dodged in the wrong direction. Um, I have something kind of embarrassing to admit. <clears throat> it's nothing bad, it's just a weird thing that I don't understand how I managed to do this, okay? I have lost my shoes. There's no punchline. Uh, oh my god, I was so lucky. There's no punchline. I have lost my shoes. It's currently Sunday. On Thursday, I went grocery shopping. So I know I had my shoes on Thursday. I came home, put my groceries away, and now I can't find my shoes. Now, I'm an American male. I have one pair of shoes that I use for every occasion, so I currently have no shoes. <laughs> I don't know how this happened. I don't know what I did. I don't know where I put them. Have you checked the fridge, says Architraz. I'm pretty sure they're not in the fridge because I, I was wearing them when I put my food away, but I, I just have no idea. I, I'm, I'm just kind of lost right now. I, I, I'm just... I got no idea. I just lost, I've lost my shoes. <laughs> Ornestan says, I left mine in the deep freeze. Ornestan says, we've all been there, nothing to feel ashamed about. You, you, we've all lost our shoes? Oh my God. Just use a blank, you freaking dummy. I'm talking to myself here. Ugh. Complete waste of meat bun. Complete total waste of meat bun. Honestly, that's the thing I'm pissed about. I don't give a crap about the Abbey. Losing the double damage from meat bun? That makes me sad. Oh, okay, well I'm happy now. Ranistan says I couldn't find my keys for a week once. Aren't they always in the last place you look? Dosbolt says, are you a sleepwalker? No. However, uh, apparently my sister is or was. Uh, I don't remember the story. I just remember it being told to me. Uh, my mom told me once that she was awoken in the middle of an, the night to a loud noise coming from my bedroom. Uh, and apparently my sister had slept walked into, into my room, into the closet and closed the door and like broke the shelves in the closet and things started like falling on her head and she woke up yelling in the closet. <laughs> and apparently I slept through the whole damn thing. Oh, you son of a gun. They keep firing, uh, lead maidens keep firing for a second after you hit him with a baseball bat. So yeah, I got no idea what happened, but uh, I am not a sleepwalker. Maybe it runs in the family though, I don't know. Is sleepwalking, you know, something contagious in the family? Okay, well, goodbye. Uh, let's get the key and then see what we can do. Because we are using the baseball bat, let's get that as well. Mud says, with the crest, I was thinking you were jinxing yourself getting the meat bun first. Well, you could have said something. <laughs> Instead of me just immediately getting hit and dying. Architraz says, I actually own far too many shoes. 
like eight pairs. Losing one wouldn't be the end of the world. I have one pair. I have one pair of shoes. I'm not gonna be able to like go anywhere or do anything this week. <laughs> Thanks, game. You give me two explosive planets and only one of them breaks bullets. I love the look of this visual background here, of the starscape. It just looks so nice. Well, we have uh, even more contact immunity. That's a lot of, a lot of dodge roll damage. Ranistan says one, care, one pair of shoes one pair of Crocs, one pair of boots. Who owns Crocs? You. Alright, let's go. What's wrong with Crocs, says Gladair? Wear Crocs? I gotta look at your, like, ugly, stinky feet. Hide your shame. <laughs> Wear covered shoes, please. Mrs. Simo says, my dog loves chewing on Crocs. Architra says, Abe's a flip-flop man. I actually, I had to go out earlier today, and so I just wore flip-flops. <laughs> but it was cold, so I also wore socks with my flip-flops. I was a sock flip-flop, flip-flop man today. But I, <laughs> I didn't have, I couldn't, I didn't have shoes. <laughs> I'm just, it's just a weird thing. It's a weird thing to lose anyways. Architress says, how Bostonian of you. <laughs> uh. Milt Thompson, welcome, says, I feel so... I don't even know, how do you pronounce that? I know it's not burger. I'll just paraphrase. Milt Thompson feels so fancy because he has a lot of different types of footwear. Burgies, maybe? Board Joyzy. <laughs> that doesn't sound right at all. Hey, I'm Bajoyzy in here. Are you not dead yet? And I really wish I didn't have this energy that makes this thing fire nails, but that's okay. Close enough. Boshwazi? Bushwa? I feel like I need to like alt tab and, and do a little bit of Google search in here. Boshwarzi? I think ev I think no one can actually spell that correctly. I think it's like Burgies. Bourgeois? That's pr actually I think that's that's probably what it is. Bourgeois. That's, that sounds familiar. I've heard that word before. I'm learned. Budgies. <laughs> uh, wrong answers only, please, chat. Wrong answers only. Oh, this is not the right gun. Bourgeoisie. Milk Jug just likes the Z, <laughs> apparently. Mark. I guess we're just using Casey on this one. Theron says pickles. I love pickles. I'll put pickles on a sandwich. I'll put pickles on a uh, on a hot dog. Here's a life pro tip: instead of getting um, relish, just get yourself a pickle and just slice a little piece off of it. And just put it on your on your freaking hot dog or something. It's easy. Then you don't need to hold two different like jars of pickles. You just have one jar of pickles and you just use it for the the freaking uh, hot dog as well. Oh, 
Well, that's a terrible gun. Lots of keys, though. Lots of keys. What do we got here? Backup gun. Well, I guess with the... Uh, uh, a planet gun, the backup gun shots will orbit me. But that's not a very high quality synergy, but it's a very good item if we can get some other weapons, like a railgun or something. Architress says, I'm pretty sure Boji is considered a hate crime by the French. <laughs> How dare you pronounce it like that, you, you uh, American cheesesteak eating grub lord? Miranda Stan, thank you very much for the gift sub to Mrs. Simo. Hello. I, every, every single time, I have to ask for a clarification. Simo or Simo? I think it's Simo. I think I'm just dumb. Apologies. Milkjug says, oh my God, I can't with you, Abe. <laughs> can't what? Simo. I had it right the first time then. I'm the, I, I second guess myself too often. Um, Audrey, welcome to the stream. How you doing today? Like Simo Butts. You should just change your Twitch name. Mrs. Simo Butts. Then I'll never forget. Yo, I like the idea of getting chance bullet shots that give us glass cannon shots, even though that's unlikely. Audrey says, I am well, how are you? I am all right. I can't complain, I'm doing pretty good. Yo mama so fat. She's got large planets orbiting her. <laughs> Yo, is that Uranus? Says Oranistan. Maybe yours. Um, are we gonna buy anything from this shop lady? <clears throat> no, is the answer. Is there a thing here? No, ooh, I do love getting planets. Hello. Yes, give in to your anger. Turn to the dark side. I guess we're done. Bourgeois. Bourgeois, thank you, Google. I think I muted myself as soon as I did that. My bad, apologies. <laughs> Mother of Zer says that made me jump. <laughs> What if I just uh, randomly have uh, conversations be played uh, out of like the left ear channel during the stream? So you're gonna be like listening to me play Gungeon and out of your left ear it's gonna be, Mother of Zerg, how's it going today? I thought you were under attack by the spy for a second there? That is not the spy's voice. Look, I might not play a lot of uh, that name of that game, but I know the spy if I hear him. That was dumb. Oh my lord, that guy is still there. Hey, come here. Maybe get a voice voice synth to read subs. I don't, you know, I don't know. Cause I, I could do that, but it runs the risk of not being in control over something that someone says. You know, it runs the r risk of, you know, something that can get you, you know, demonetized. And I wouldn't like to not have that happen. You know, if, if we get to like, you know, 18 million subs, then I could afford to like pay a moderator to moderate messages. But until that happens, you know, it's uh, it's just me running the show here. 
I'm sure you figured that part out by yourself. I mean, you see the quality of this gig I'm running here? Some of them have an automod feature built in, says Milk Jug. I mean, it's it's not even. Um, well, okay, I mean, here's here's the deal. Automod's not perfect. That's about it. Automod's not perfect, and then also there might be things that I would still prefer not to uh, reference, but I wouldn't have any control over it, would I? Because it would just be there. I guess it, 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 to an extent. The message still gets displayed on screen, but I can, I, I don't have to acknowledge it, you know? Milt Thompson says, some of my students had lots of fun with the name Nigel the other day. You mean Thornberry? Must have been a, a yesterday's run thing. Renistan says, was it Elder Ring that auto-censored the word butt so that when someone put butter in it looked much worse? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that sounds about right. That sounds about right. Okay, just realizing Commando actually pretty good with the backup gun. Bard of Bobrich, welcome. How you doing today? Kind of reminds me of the on oh, disposable says it kind of reminds me of the head ninja in charge episode from Black Dynamite. Dynamite! <laughs> Dynamite! I have I'm going to be honest with you. I've never actually seen Dynamite. <laughs> well, no. I've never seen Black Dynamite the series, but I have seen Black Dynamite the film. Anaconda malt liquor. And then I forget how the rest of it goes. Gives you a little Richard. Let's go for key and let's go for scope. Slower enemy bullets. T minus 30 seconds until Abe blames slow bullets for him, him taking a little bit of damage. Him. I am taking some damage. Bullets are pretty slow, though. You know what? Galactic Medal of Valor. That's why we are doing more damage and having a better reload speed. Does that synergize with? So slower enemy bullets. Hidden tech time, yeah. I actually think this one is worse than just having um, slower enemy bullets, but I, I think the benefit is that it doesn't mess with charge weapons anymore, maybe? No, it still messes with charge weapons. It does freeze everything, but only temporarily. Okay, we will uh, probably just leave. Is there anything that we want to gun munch? Absolutely. Bum, 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 bum. We got a shot bow. I mean, we did get a bit of an accuracy upgrade, so shot bow is actually pretty interesting. And don't forget Snowball, it's like we're not really utilizing it, but Snowball, it does exist on this run. Okay, I mean, I think we're done. Didn't find any secret rooms, did I? No, well in that case. Not there, we'll check out this room. I'd rather, should I just use a blank? Yeah, 
You know what? All right, fair enough. <clears throat> Excuse me, let's get out of here. Big Stinky Monkey says, I will personally read out your sub notifications for absolutely free. <laughs> oh my God, I, I, I hate when I forget someone's name. Okay, I'm gonna preface by saying this. I forget who it was who sent me a recording of, of themselves saying, you're watching Abe, and I put it as the intro to one of my like Gungeon runs. It wasn't Flytris, I don't think. Someone else who starts with an F, maybe? I'm bad at remembering stuff uh, sometimes. Let's, let's, let's go with sometimes. Yo, do you think, um, <clears throat> sorry, does the uh, orange guanstone get extra bullets sometimes? Because sometimes I feel like I am firing more projectiles than I should be, and I don't quite understand what's doing it. Intech time does have its uses, though. Part of Bobrich asks, is there a hunting quest today? Oh, there is, buddy. There is, it's a hunting quest that's gonna take five runs. The current hunting quest, I guess I, I didn't um, bring it up. The current hunting quest though is the dragon, so it's just five runs away. And then I'll be done with the hunting quests forever. It'll be a freaking miracle. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh, baby! You've got what I need! Finally! <laughs> After all this time, he's finally done it. Now we just need, like, Backup, sorry, not backup ships. We need bouncing shots. Please. Alpha bullets, omega bullets, something that means that the shots that go out of my back go forward. Ammo regen, I don't care what. You know, do we even have uh, the blue bandana unlocked? Do you unlock it? I don't know. I'd love to see it though. Dun, 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 dun. Either way, this uh, dragon should be a pretty easy kill. How did you die? Gladier says, what is he missing for 100%? Um, I mean, I need to pick up items, but everything should be unlocked at this point. We could, we could check the, um, we could check the uh, the log, the monster log. Good shot. Thank you, Orange Guan Stone. Pretty good for just like peppering those guys. I don't know how that enemy exploded. I'm hoping that we'll find something at the shop. Homing bullets, alpha, omega. I don't care what. Do you think you could do a run with uh, one orange guan stone per floor? I'm asking you specifically, not me, by the way. That was a complete waste of a blank. I. I I just wanted to blank to deal with this guy, but I just realized after the fact that that was my last blank. It's gonna be a lot harder to defeat the dragon. Oh wait, I've got a gun.
Robot has a gun. What item is doing time freeze thingy? That is a synergy between table tech sight, which has the slow motion effect on it and triple shot, table tech sight and slower enemy bullets, the monster eye item, or liquid Valkyrie, whichever one. Okay. <gasps> no! No! Okay, I mean, we can still get in there. It's just... Hold on. That's not how this is gonna work. Ah, oh, that'll work. Snowballer, so that's a snowball synergy. We've seen this one before, though. I got a lot of keys, oh my lord. Hello. Hello. I'm surprised that doesn't kill you. As soon as we hit a uh, hundred and four, we could go back to the shop and pick up. Um. Pick up chaos bullets or broccoli. I think Chaos Bullets, it has a chance of giving us stuff like homing and freezing, which might affect the makeshift cannon, but Broccoli is just a damage upgrade, right? Jesus, the slowdown is so annoying here. So like, if it's a damage upgrade, maybe, we'll, maybe we would just like to have that. I'd like that. Oh, okay, we're gonna take both. Beautiful. <laughs> All right, you know what? That's That was like 144 credits dropped from that chest. Thank you very much. Let's do this. Let's do it. Okay, I think some of the shots missed, which is weird, because I have like... Well, I'm out of ammo on that weapon too. I have like... A scope. You would think that the makeshift cannon would be more accurate. But I guess not. That's okay. No, the skull still sees me. Now the question is, can I, like, go get a, uh... The ammo drop from the shop. Was there an ammo drop even? I might not be able to steal it, but we can try. Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful, yes. Yes. I guess it, the makeshift cannon did, did do like half damage. Ammo? Oh, I don't even, don't even have it charged up. Okay, well in that case, let's get the heck out of here. I, I tried to use the smoke bomb to get away from one screaming skull. That <laughs> didn't go well, did it? Take a drink. Bourgeois. If I can remember that, there's the title of today's run. <laughs> uh, I love making stupid titles. Hey, get out of here. You know, the funny part is, I think the bullet actually disappeared before it reached me. Is that funny or sad? Yes. Return of the French? Return of the French bourgeois. Return of the French bogey. Huh. 
I do love whenever I actually remember that I have slow motion bullets, though. Oh good, another key. Words that you never thought you would hear in a Gungeon Run. Oh good, another key. Thanks for nothing, game. I do, I do really enjoy that, uh, when you knock back an enemy bullet, it immediately gets big due to Snowball, because it's been in the air for a long time, I think. Whoops. Get out of here. Get out of here! I'm on fire. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, let's be honest. How many of you could have possibly seen that coming? I still haven't even looked into what causes that issue with Table Tech Site. I really should. <clears throat> Milk Jug says, I hate being sick, I'm so tired I can't sleep because my throat hurts too much and NyQuil only lasts for four hours. I'm sorry to hear that, I am. I also hate being sick. I hate having freaking allergies, it's not the same, but it still has me sneezing all day. And just being completely miserable, basically. Mm, is that the first? Yeah. I think up is the direction to go in. Oh my god! That was a big bullet, and I walked into the enemy who pushed me into the drink. I didn't even know I hit any of those uh, enemy bullets, but I made one of his bullets freaking huge. It was a giant pizza cutter. Oh, I could go for some pizza, man. Hey, come here. You, come here. Hey, come here. All right, never mind. <laughs> Jesus. I mean, look at the size of those bullets. If only my bullets were that size. If your bullets are that large for more than four hours. I turned him into a chicken with a baseball bat. Okay, we got some ammo, thank God. Um, I gotta go makeshift cannon first. It's our first makeshift cannon run of the damn save file. I have to. I'm contractually obligated. I unlocked an item, I gotta use it. Where are you? Hey. Oh, you son of a... I have no idea what happened. I feel like the game cheated. In my favor, of course. I feel like I should have taken damage, but the game said, nah, you're okay. Like, I thought the game had lagged because I got hit and it was waiting, it was like trying to pop all the armor. I got lucky. You think you're lucky, punk? Hold on. You think you're... You Trying to hit him backwards. Hold on, knock it off. It's kind of working. It just takes a little bit of finesse. You've got to get real close. Oh god, that was my bullet. Or rather, my reflected bullet. 
Well, two down, one to go. Big Stinky Monkey says, take four doses of NyQuil at once, sleep will no longer be a problem. It would probably knock you out pretty well. What the heck? I did that one to myself, let's be honest. Who could have seen that coming? Hey. Oh my god, I killed him with one dodge roll. I have been neglecting the dodge roll, admittedly. We've got some pretty hefty dodge roll damage if I can kill these enemies in one one shot. I have to do another room now. I'm like, hold on, I gotta, I gotta do a room without Attacking. Hey. 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 This should have been like the past 30 minutes of this run. You flip the table, you freeze time, and then you dodge into every enemy. That's so good. We got ammo. Okay, I'm actually extremely glad we kept going because that is dumb and great. Hello. <laughs> Jammed enemies would take three shots. That's still not that bad. And you can probably like calculate the damage off of that knowledge. Okay, that's not the best. <laughs> I don't know, I kinda wanna do the rest of the floor now. I'm like, okay. I, I like this dodge roll thing we got going on here. Hey guys. What's up? We're actually like, we have gained plenty of resources and strength doing this. Got him. Give me a second, dude. Gotta wait for your friend to spawn. Honestly, I think dodge rolling made the floor easier. <laughs> uh, I love doing that. All right. Let's finish off this lich. If that is your real name. <sighs> Part of Bob Rich says, I would use Fisherman's Friend if I can get it in your area. That's like a that's like a Canadian thing, right? Bart, are you a Canadian? Are you a Canada man? Canada man. Da, 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 da. Oh, 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 no, 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 oh, there goes my ammo. I really wanted to try to like push him into the uh, into the no man's land of he's being stuck and he's being bullied, but it didn't work. Anyways, that was still a super fast fight. That was a fun run. A lot of Casey picked up the makeshift cannon, one shot the Lich, dodge rolled into a lot of enemies on the on the bullet hell floor. Now that I remember that I actually had dodge roll damage, that was pretty good. That's pretty good. That's what I need every day. A nice warm up gungeon run to get me excited for today's recording session. 
beautiful. For those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe for more, check me out on Twitch. Or when I go live, support the channel at any of the links below in the video description. And I hope to see you here again for the next run of Enter the Gungeon.